Welcome to the AutoPulse NXT Resuscitation System in-service video series. This multi-part series provides detailed information about the AutoPulse NXT mechanical CPR device and its functionality. This series serves as an adjunct to formal training. Please take time to read the user guide available at zoll.com. Proper use of the system requires a thorough understanding of the product, appropriate training, and practice. In this module, we review how to install and remove the battery. The AutoPulse NXT resuscitation system is powered by a rechargeable lithium ion battery. The charge time for the battery is typically two hours. The runtime of one battery is typically 30 minutes. It's important to check battery status every 30 days and prior to use by pressing the white battery status indicator button. Always rotate batteries when they display fewer than four bars. Before installing a battery in the AutoPulse NXT resuscitation system, fully charge the battery in the battery charger. This brings batteries out of low power storage mode. Also, ensure the battery compartment located at the top of the platform is clear. Slide the battery into the compartment. It should snap into place flush with the platform. To check the battery status in the AutoPulse NXT platform, press Status Check to view the battery charge level. Four green bars indicate the battery has a charge greater than 75% and is ready for use in the platform. Should you need to remove the battery, lift the finger ring and rotate it clockwise to the unlocked position. Hold the platform firmly and pull the battery out until it is clear of the battery compartment. We have now reviewed battery installation and removal for the AutoPulse NXT resuscitation system.